Now let's focus on one of the main innate immune system cellular reactions, which is phagocytosis. Firstly, the inflammatory mediators stimulate the endothelium to exhibit the adhesion molecules. Then, the neutrophils are attracted and come in contact with the active endothelial adhesive molecules. This contact results in activation of neutrophils. The active neutrophils are adhered to the endothelium. This is followed by sliding of the whole neutrophil cells through narrow endothelium gaps. This sliding transfers the whole neutrophils outside the blood vessels. Then, the extravascular neutrophils start to phagocytose the invading microbes. Then, they digest and degrade the invaders. It is important to know that the neutrophils are usually the first arrivals to the sites of microbe invasion. In fact, they are the predominant cells in pus. The neutrophils phagocytosis step is boosted by an invasion of huge amounts of other phagocytic cells, such as macrophages, dendritic cells, and B cells. These cells engulf and digest the invaders. Then, the phagocytes present some segments of the invading antigens on their cell surfaces. Therefore, they are called antigen-presenting cells, APCs. This video is narrated by Hassan Nawab, medical student at King's College London.